वेलकम टू मैथ्स एंड साइंस बाय आईआईटी एंड चैनल इन दिस लेक्चर वी हैव टेकन अप वन क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम जेई मेंस 2025 रिगार्डिंग एक्सपोनेंशियल फंक्शंस एंड एक्सपोनेंशियल फंक्शंस आर डेल्ट बाय एस इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स to the maximum extent possible whatever we have learnt from the previous lectures those concepts we apply here and we try to solve, try to solve this question the question is we have to find the product of all the solutions available for this equation e to the power of 5 into ln x whole square Plus three is equal to x to the power of eight. This is the equation. This equation we have to solve and try to find the product of the roots. Now let us go ahead. It is in the form something e to the power of something. What is that something? e to the power of 5 ln x whole square plus 3 this is e to the power of something is equal to x to the power of something that is x to the power of 8 now let us take natural logarithms on both sides natural logs on both sides what happens if i take natural logarithm on anything like e to the power of a is given if i take the natural logarithm ln a into ln e to the base e it becomes when i take the natural logarithm Similarly, when I take the natural logarithm of five into ln x whole square plus three is equal to x to the power of eight, when I take the natural logarithm, what happens? Five into ln x whole square. Plus three, this something into ln e to the base e is equal to eight into ln x because x to the power of a when log is taken it becomes a ln x. This is what is the equation we have got. What is ln e? But ln e to the base e is equal to unity. Please remember this. This I have told many times to you in the previous lectures. Please refer to my previous lectures in the same playlist. That is mathematics by IIT. And around sixty lectures I have released. Please see them. You will get the basic concepts of complex numbers, vectors. Everything you will get. Now, five ln x square plus three into one. Five ln x square plus three into one is equal to eight ln x. That implies five ln x square plus three is equal to eight ln x. Do you agree? Let ln x is equal to y. Call it something, some y. Then it will be five y square plus three is equal to eight y. That implies five y square minus eight y plus three is equal to zero. Then whenever Here, the equation to be solved is 
5y square minus 8y plus 3 is equal to 0. That implies sum of the roots of this equation. Sum of the roots is equal to minus of minus 8 by 5. That is equal to 8 by 5. Why? Because if you recollect your basic mathematics, bx square, ax square plus bx plus c implies sum of roots is equal to minus b by a. Hence, sum of roots here, b is equal to minus 8 and a is equal to 5 here. Hence, sum of the roots is 8 by 5. When sum of the roots means what it is? y1 plus y2 is equal to 8 by 5. What is y1? y1 is ln x1 because we have assumed y is equal to ln x plus y2 is ln x2 that is equal to 8 by 5. ln x1 plus ln x2 log a plus log b is equal to log a into b. That implies ln x1 and x2 is equal to 8 by 5. That implies ln x is equal to a means x is equal to e to the power of a x1 x2 is equal to e to the power of 8 by 5. What are the basics we have understood here? Logarithm of a plus logarithm of b is equal to logarithm of a into b. One concept. Because it is better to understand the concept and discuss the concepts here itself. It's not getting the answer. It's getting the Concepts is more important. Ln A plus Ln B is equal to Ln into A, Ln A into B. Second is Ln X to the power of Y is equal to X to the power of Y when log is taken, it becomes Y Ln X. That also you should know because that is also basics we have applied. This is one, this is second. What is the third basics we have applied? Another concept ln e to the base e is equal to one. That is also one of the important things to be understood. And in quadratic expressions, ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 implies sum of the roots is equal to minus b by a. It's also very important. And with this, we got the answer as you see how many concepts are combined in this problem and we got the answer as x1, x2, product of the solutions is equal to e to the power of 8 by 5. This answer is available in the options and you can easily then concepts these four concepts are ready with you then you can easily by visualizing the problem without much issues you can point out the correct answer and you will answer it in the question exactly 
with correct answer so that you will get the good marks the first and foremost is to understand the question and to is to understand the concept behind it and apply the concept and get the answer once you practice more and more problems then your process will be faster please try to solve as many problems as possible please try to see my videos for good co concepts on exponentials exponential functions and natural logarithms quadratic equations because these are all dealt in detail in those vector classes please see them that is that playlist is mathematics by iitn this is the playlist and my channel is maths and science by iitn if any value addition is there with this video to your knowledge please share my videos for the benefit of others and also to subscribe to my channel best of luck to everybody please do better practice the tests please see my videos repeatedly there are around 61 videos are there covering topics on vectors exponential equations lambert functions many many topics are covered which are useful for both maths olympiad and also iit jee mains and advanced also i have solved advanced questions also in the previous videos please see them best of luck thank you for listening to me thank you for viewing my lecture